Hey guys, I'm LB, and let's check out Beam Me Up by Pikachu, requested by Pikachu. Find clever ways to exploit and maximize the potential of given beams. Difficulty medium-ish. This has me a bit nervous, and uh, this also has me rather nervous. There's a difference between complexity and challenge, I'll have you know. Anyway, let's just get started, I suppose. Oh my gosh, there is so much stuff. It is very, very difficult to make a true medium difficulty puzzle when you have so much stuff, not to mention all the other stuff we can't even see yet. What did I even... what? Okay, so it's that? Why though? Okay, then. What is even happening right now? Hey, what's up there? Why is that a thing? There's nothing even up there. There's nothing even up there. Weird. Uh, I don't actually see how to begin. Where's Dot? There's so much signage in this map. Hmm. I can see that I have access to the funnel, but I don't really see how that helps me, because I can't actually go anywhere with it. Well, there's also that funnel up there, but that doesn't help much either. I can't even tell what I'm supposed to be doing right now. That's not gonna do anything for me. I don't see... cubes or anything? I don't see a way... to like... quickly press this button and then get over to this? That doesn't seem like a thing I can do. Maybe I can do it. Maybe. Come on, we gotta try this again. I don't think this is gonna be fast enough, honestly. And now I'm stuck here. Well, let's do this, and this, and see where this takes us. Not anywhere particular. Wait, what is that for? What did I need the other thing for if I could just do this? What- what did I need this for? Okay then, I just hope that's permanent. Cause if not, we're gonna be... in some trouble. How do we actually get up there though? Hmm. Don't see a good way to do that, honestly. Is this area supposed to be so I could build up velocity and then do this? Oh yeah, I guess that works. Sure. Well, there's Dot. Still don't know what that's for. Well, that was weird. What did I hit on the wall there? There we go. That jump's easily makeable. Uh, why are there turrets? That seems a bit unnecessary, in my opinion. Hmm. 
Let's pretend I did make the jump. And, uh, let's get that. And then we make the jump again. There we go. What was the point of that turret? Why... What is the point of this, anyway? That's what I wanna know. It was like, we're just... going around and around in tubes? It's not particularly engaging, to be honest. Well... I don't really understand what the point of the turrets is, that's not really a puzzle, that's just an annoyance. Looks like I had to press the button and then something else... They, they had ant lines underneath the turrets. To kill them, I guess. I guess we can just ignore that one, because that one seems pretty pointless. I don't know what the ceiling portal surface is for, because we can just do this. Oh, what's that up there? Ouch! Excuse me. Well, I'm not really sure what to do here, honestly. Oh, that was death. Oh well. Maybe we should go somewhere else, I don't know. Let's go somewhere else. There we go. Nice runway. Might as well get one in this direction as well. Never know what you might need a runway for. Oh, that one's not gonna be too useful because the button's in the way. The pedestal button. Hmm. Oh, is that where the button goes, huh? Maybe I'm supposed to use this funnel then. Let's try that. Maybe the funnel reverses when I don't expect it to. So let's follow this antline and pay close attention to where it goes. Because it might be that button I pressed actually reverses it. Oh, yep, sure enough. I thought the antline went up there, but evidently not. Yep, that's exactly what it does. Not exactly clear. Yeah, see, what's the point of those turrets if it's that easy to get rid of them? Well, we have a cube now, I suppose. That's- that's permanent, right? Yeah, okay. So. Here we are. I'll just put that down right there. Not sure what for, but I'll do it. What turns that off? Can't really tell. I guess that area is completely unnecessary now. We don't need to go to it ever again, because we've done everything that we can- we need to do. And yeah, what was- what was this for? What was that for? That's how I pressed the button. Something tells me I broke this in multiple ways already. Right, well. Let's, um... Here. Alright, you. You're going in the funnel. Let's do that. And... Cube in the funnel. 
hopefully it'll go onto the button. Come on, get on there, cube. Yes, and check this out! Aaron hooked me up with a green light bridge. My light bridges are green now. Much better than blue, anyway. Specifically dark green, not- not lime green or light green or any of the other ugly shades of green. The, the best shade of green, dark green. Like- like my portals. Hmm. So that's... only gonna be like that for as long as it's on the button, right? I sure hope this works. Okay, that worked. I guess we're just in here now, permanently, for the rest of time. What? <laughs> that was interesting. Oh, it's one of these stupid things. Yeah, these- these aren't particularly fun, you know. Particularly fun, to be honest. Not really a puzzle either, they're just a tedious thing that you have to do. Right, so now that we've done that, I'll just put that there for now, right? That allows us to... nothing. Okay, apparently that's required. Stairs, okay. We walk up the stairs, and now we're up here, I guess. Another one! Why, though? Wait, what? Does this one not reverse? I'm not exactly sure what's going on in this room, to be honest. I can't actually tell what is happening. I guess we can bring the cube up here with us? Excuse me, I'd like to pass through, please. There. Let's see if this gets us anywhere. I guess it might. Oh, that's not- that's not what I wanted to do. Uh, thank goodness that's there. There, I can push back onto the button if I wanted to. There's that. There we go. That should allow us to easily get back out of here. Just walk on down off the funnel. And, uh... Sort of. There we go. We're out of here now. Right. Portal there. Portal here. And we are out of here. Yeah, so this- this wasn't really- this wasn't medium, this was very easy. It's just that there was a lot of steps and a lot of things to do. So it was very complex, but it was not very challenging. There's a difference between complexity and challenge. There was a lot of things, but not a lot of challenge. And I would recommend looking at Rectorox's guide, which you can find by going to the guides tab and searching for Rectorox. With a K. And, uh, you'll find this one, Rector's Guide to Making Better Hammer Maps. Or, Making Better Maps, Hammer Included. But you can ignore, ignore the hammer parts and just focus on the Puzzle Maker parts. So, yeah. And then there's also Demon Arisen's series on YouTube called How to Make Great Test Chambers, which you can find by just searching that on YouTube. Anyway, let's, uh, let's get out of here. Right. Well, guys, as always, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it, and I'll see you all in another video.
Goodbye.